All right, Shalom. First, we'd like to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakhakodesh. Double honor to our venerable apostles and elders at Great Millstone. Peace and salutations to the elect. Hey, man. Hey, a round of applause for the Most High, man. This is beautiful, man. Hey, call Allah Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shai, man. Call Allah Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shai. Hey, we just saw this video uh, Dabu posted. It says, uh, virus contact tracing for all Singapore uh, Singaporeans to be tracked by government in post-COVID world. Mm -hmm. Okay, and the first thing they, they start talking about is uh, 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 some type of microchip, man. Yeah, it's, it's like, literally going to say it. That's it, microchip. So <clears throat> the first thing we thought about is, hey, the mark of the beast is being rolled out right now, man, because they already got the stage set up. Okay, the stage is already set, and by this whole COVID thing, they used it as a means to introduce the world to what? That new world, man. Now, the question is, why of all devices do you choose a chip? Mm. You know, every it seems everything, every problem they come up with, the only solution that everybody keeps talking about when it comes to technology is chip. That's mm. all you keep hearing, microchip this, microchip this. You're going to put an RFID chip in a syringe. Mm. You want to put a microchip in a, in a bracelet. You know, you want to listen. We're going to read the article. You're going to hear it. You God, it's, 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 you know, it's spiritual, too, <clears throat> because like lately, I think it was yesterday or two days ago, the elder apostle did a video. And, you know, you got somebody in one of the uh, camps talking about uh, the, the mark of the beast being Christianity. Yep. You know what I'm saying, and then the Lord counteracts it right, right away with this. Mm -hmm. It's it's kind of crazy too that this this came out in, in when June. Mm. All right, it's ain't June. No microchip. Ain't no microchip, but it's June. There's a microchip, man. That's it. <laughs> all right, so let's see. Uh, it says Singapore. All right, is on the cusp of rolling out a mandatory, check it, mandatory, and we're gonna bring out what's in Revelation. All mm -hmm. right, but it says mandatory, meaning it, it has to be had. Mm -hmm. All right, COVID nineteen tracing program. That will identify people who have come in contact with virus carriers. Now, if you notice, these elites always they'll they'll, they'll throw it into a, another country, all right, or somewhere to see how it plays out. Sick. Yes, they want to implement the chip, but they do it in measures because they want to make sure it's it's fully certain when they make it worldwide. Mm. So they start with Singapore, it works good, then they can make reference. Oh, look at Singapore, mm -hmm. look at the thing they uh, instituted, and look how good it's working. Mm -hmm. Let's adopt that and use that. Let's God. let's update it and tweak it so now we can just put the chip inside you. God. And they're using what something called contact tracing, which we already have here in America. Right. All right. You getting all these uh, phone updates. You have your location set and set on. Actually, there's a a, a thing. Uh, uh, let me see. Hold on, real quick. It's um. You go into your phone and you type in. You click on uh, I believe. Uh, damn, where's that thing at? There's this thing. Uh oh, research. You click on research. It's gonna show you. All right. Um, everything that your phone has been tracking so far, man, it's gonna is literally tracking everything that you're doing, everywhere you're going, and it's gonna give you all the analytics of where you've been and who you've been around and all this stuff, man. Mm -hmm. So a lot of people don't even have their mm -hmm. settings uh, set right, but uh, Apple, even uh, without your permission, uh, even Microsoft too, with the Androids, without your uh, permission, all right, they can um, turn it on and, and track wherever you at. Good. Okay. So a lot of people being let out right now, thinking that oh we can just protest and they've let everybody out. No, they're just doing that to set you up. So you have no excuse. They say, look, you went outside, you were partying, you were around a lot of people. You have no choice but to get tested. And it, whether you like it or yes, you're going to get tested. It's going to be positive and you have to take this thing. Okay. Right, right. So let's let's keep reading. <clears throat> all right. It says what? Uh, the program, all right, will distribute tiny microchips. Whoa. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> microchips <laughs> is June. Ain't no microchip. Well, it says distribute microchips to all 5.7 million residents in all it says in what will be the most extensive tracing program globally so wait hold on it's a mandatory covid 19 tracing program mm. notice whenever they mention the chip they always say no it can't track you but for covid's sake the purpose of it has to be to track you that's right. the excuse right so this program that is mandatory involves distributing tiny microchips mm. to all 5.7 million residents then they start off with Oh, it's just something you wear. Mm. But then, then the problem comes, what if you lose it? Mm. What about people who try to find a way around that? Mm -hmm. We need to find a, me a method for those kind of people. Right. So instead, we're just going to put it inside you. Right. And you notice, they could have just said, uh, uh, and distribute microchips. They said tiny because mm -hmm. for the longest, they've always told you, it's as small as a grain of rice. Mm -hmm. So when you hear the word small, you're thinking, oh, it's not a big deal. Small, automatic, oh, it's not a big deal. It's not. A, it's, it's, it's actually a good thing. It's a small change that we have to make in life. Mm -hmm. Little did you know, it's a change that you're going to make to pledge your life to the devil. Mm -hmm. All right, it says, reported uh, Reuters, it says, the city state, all right, police state, located in South, uh, Southeast Asia, has already developed a tracing app for smartphones called Trace uh, Together. Mm -hmm. All right, 
to identify people who have interacted with virus carriers. Mm -hmm. Now, how do you know who has a virus and who doesn't? All right, so they're going to say, no, we don't, we don't know. So everybody got it. Mm -hmm. All right, just assume we all got it. All right, it says the app was downloaded by more than 1.5 million residents but did not work well on iPhone since Bluetooth activity goes dormant when app runs uh, in the background. Now, How convenient. Right. <laughs> now, hold on. If all 5.7 million people would have downloaded that thing, they would have never came out and said it didn't work. But they only said it didn't work because only 1.5 million people did it. They were waiting for everybody to do it. <clears throat> now, if everybody can't do it, they're going to say, look, why didn't they do it? Okay, well, let's find the problems why they, they didn't do it and let's find the solutions for it. They're going to come up with solution after solution until they, the, the problem is people just don't want to do it. Okay, it's not it's not about they can't do it. No, they just don't want to. Now, those who don't want to, you got another thing coming. John, I okay. mean, you need to tell me with how innovative the uh, Apple is and how innovative these people are with technology. They can't come up with an app that, that works, that functions well. Mm. It seems there's always a problem when when... When the solution is anything but the chip, that there's always a problem with it, mm. you know, and mm. there will always be a problem until the solution is the chip. Then, right. oh, no, it's perfect. Right, exactly. <laughs> it says Singapore officials overseeing the tracing app had several discussions with Apple, but no resolutions were found. Mm -hmm. um, Minister in charge of the Smart Nation Initiative, Vivian Balakrishnan. Oh, yeah, no, it's a lot. Uh, Minister in charge uh, of the Smart Nation Initiative, Vivian ba Bala Krishnan, all right, uh, spoke with Parliament on Friday, gave members of the government update on the tracing program. And this mm -hmm. is a quote. It says, because Trace Together does not work equally well across all smartphones, we have decided, therefore, at this point, not to mandate the compulsory use of Trace Together. Mm -hmm. So soon it's going to be compulsory, meaning mandatory. Mm -hmm. But instead of, instead, of, instead, of not, instead of mandating the app, this is their solution. Right. Quote, we are developing and will soon roll out a portable, wearable device that will not depend on the possession of a smartphone. So are you having problems with your smartphone? Oh, don't worry. We'll fix it for you. Mm. We'll give you something you can wear that has not that has nothing to do with your smartphone. Right. And the only device that's going to be good <clears throat> is to be inside your body. That way you can't lose it. Right, you know? right, right, right. You can't lose it. It says, and there's another quote, it says, if this portable device works... Portable meaning it can move around. What can what 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 is this what is this leading to? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, it says we may then distribute it to everyone in Singapore. This will be more inclusive and will and it will ensure that all of us will be protected, quote unquote. Now, they are always using it as work looking for your greater good. This is to protect you, and the the the, the sheeple will follow it. But those who stand up, the rams and the and the sheep who are gonna say, now nah, we're gonna fight back. Guess what? They're gonna be they're gonna be broken down if they don't if they're not part of the elect. Okay, uh, it says uh, Balakrishna, <clears throat> all right, said the pivot uh, to wearables would mean residents will have to wear a tiny microchip at the end of a lanyard or can be carried in pocket or bag. He expects it to be rolled out in the near term. Now, what is that? you hmm. gotta you gotta really think about it, right? They know, all right. They know by saying this. The, the main problem that's going to arise is that what it, it's it's you, you can lose it mm -hmm. who 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 never loses a, a lanyard if it's a, if it's oh I lost my if people can lose their wallet and can lose their phones how much more a tiny microchip right at the end of a lanyard right okay right. or or in a pocket or in a bag you mm -hmm. can easily lose it right so first they they push this and then they say ah oh, damn look at us how silly of us we didn't even think about the fact that you can lose it <laughs> mm, let's make it more easier so you don't lose it and let's put it inside you how's right, that that right, sounds good right <laughs> right again they, 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 they're basing all this on your fear and people are going to be it, the second wave is coming <laughs> that's why it says in the next term in the near term the near term is talking about the next term of being under lockdown because of covid which will and justify them to do that. that's it and bill <laughs> gates already came out and said what until you have a vaccine you don't expect to be going out and you got people going out so they said look you got to bring them back in because that's not the plan mm. you see it says the technology behind the wearable was not discussed and at what range the government can track people. Mm. So they are going to track people. This is all about. All right, it's all about control. It says there are many privacy concerns about tracing devices, especially when the government wants widespread use. It will have to make it mandatory. Other concerns are about who gets the tracking data. And it was said that the Singapore government would only collect data via the first app if a person becomes infected with COVID-19. Mm. There are many privacy concerns about contact tracing devices and how the government will use the data. Well, guess what? 
they'll put your mind to rest when your fear, all right, supersedes your your concern for privacy. Right. All right. They'll make it to where you're willing to give up your privacy for your life or mm -hmm. or out of fear. Mm -hmm. Then you're not gonna worry about all this. Right. It says, for instance, this week the U.S. government, uh oh, mm -hmm. the U.S. government and law enforcement agencies are using contact tracing and big tech to identify rioters. Whoa. Mm -hmm. So that means if you're out there rioting, guess what? They already know who you are. Yep. And they're going to come see you. Mm -hmm. It says the war on COVID. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. <clears throat> the invisible enemy. I mean, invisible meaning that it's not there. You can't see it. It says the war on COVID. And that's, that shows you how stupid people really have become, man. You know? It's become so bad that they actually told you about an invisible enemy and you actually believed it, man. That's crazy to me. Right, right. It says the war on COVID around the world has ushered in a massive surveillance state with weaponry that governments can deploy at any time. Thermal Im imaging cameras, drones, contact tracing, biometric database, etc. Biometric database? Mm. Biometric database. Right. <laughs> and this is right here. No one is safe from government in a post-corona world. Mm -mm. Oh, man. That already, it that's it. That's it, man. You so know a precept, you, got you already know. You already know. This is a book of Revelation. Chapter 13, start off at uh, start off at 15, all right? Actually, let's get straight to the point. Verse 16, it says, no, you know what? 15, it says, and he had power to give life unto the image of the beast, that the image of the beast should both speak and cause that as many as would not worship the image of the beast should be killed. So what's that talking about? It's talking about the, the, the ability to speak. It's talking about those laws and litigations that they're going to bring about, those draconian measures. Okay, and you're going to have to abide by those laws, man. And it says what? Uh, and those who would not, as many as would not worship, meaning succumb to that, that image, that, mm -hmm. that way of the living, system, yeah. the system, <clears throat> all right, of the beast should be killed. Mm -hmm. All right, and how are you going to be killed? The scriptures tell you that you're going to be beheaded. Mm -hmm. All right, it says what? And he causeth all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond. Now, when, you, when we were reading the article, it said, in Singapore, it said what? All mm -hmm. of the residents. It didn't say, oh, the uh, the politicians are excluded or those in jail are excluded or the, the bums on the street are excluded. No, everybody's going to get it. You know why? Because COVID doesn't discriminate. Mm -hmm. So when we're fighting against COVID, we can't discriminate either. Right, right, right. Exactly. <clears throat> Good point. It says what? Uh, free and bond to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads and they're ruling it out is in the form of a microchip. Okay. It says what? And that no man might buy or sell. So right now they're pushing the idea of what? It's to protect you from a virus. Mm -hmm. Soon it's going to be... Multi-purpose. Multi, um, uh, uh, functional. Like, exactly. Yeah, multi-functional. Because right. soon what they'll do is the chip will adjust to all the problems that are coming. Oh, mm. the COVID problem? Don't worry, the chip got you. Oh, uh, the, 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 economic, uh, the economic problem? Oh, don't worry, the, the, chip, the chip got you. That'll be the new currency. Mm -hmm. So the chip can do multiple things. Right. You know? Multi-purpose. <clears throat> right, multi-purpose. It says, And no man might buy or sell, save he that had the mark, meaning the chip, all right, or the name of the beast, or the number of his name. Mm -hmm. Here is wisdom. Let him that hath understanding count the number of the beast, for he, for it is the number of a man, and his number is 603 score and 6. That's it. All right. That's it. Uh, also, you could get Revelation to, uh, 12 and 12. Okay. And then we could close it on that because that's that's basically what they're gonna do. Mm -hmm. They're gonna come hard, man, with this second wave. Mm -hmm. They're gonna come hard. I, I just saw um, the thumbnail for one of the brothers, um, uh, GMS Awakening 144. I didn't get to watch the video yet, but I, it has something to do, I think, with the um, the Patriot Act. Mm. Apparently, they renewed it again or something of that sort. Mm. All right, mm. but uh, I'll, I'll watch it and I'll see what's going into. But hey, they they they're not playing, man. Mm -hmm. They're getting right. Look, they're tired of dragging their feet. They're tired of, of tiptoeing. They're just about to come down like, like we're about to read. Right. They set you up for this. Mm -hmm. It says, therefore, Revelation chapter 12, verse 12, therefore rejoice ye heavens and ye that dwell in them. Woe to the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea. And they don't even know it. That's the sad part. A lot mm -hmm. of these people don't even know the kind of the, uh, destruction that they're being set up for. Mm -hmm. You know, they're being fat, like in the story of Hansel and Gretel, mm -hmm. they're being fattened up. So that witch could eat them. Right. You know, right. they think, oh, she's such a nice witch. Mm. Why do you think she's fattening you up? Mm. You know? <laughs> mm. It says, for the devil has come down onto you, having great wrath, because he knoweth that he hath but a short time. Mm -hmm. That's okay. why they're going to move quick, man. Mm -hmm. Man, they didn't waste no time in, 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 in already uh, paving the way for the second wave. Right, they, right now, they're talking about uh, certain states are getting, like, what, eight, 
8,000 cases in a week mm-hmm. in Florida or, or California or so. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So they're not, they're not wasting any time, man. Right. They're moving fast, and that's good. That's to our, our advantage because the sure. faster these prophecies come to pass, the faster your house shot can come down, and the faster we can get into our, our rest. All right, hey, everything is everything is moving fast because your house shot said, uh, lest the days be shortened. Uh, be like saved. Exactly. No the, flesh shall be saved. Shall yep. be saved, exactly. So right now the days are moving extremely fast, man. We were just in January when COVID just broke out, and we're already in June, man. Right. You know what I'm saying? And and when we were in like a, around March, April, Buzz was talking about how, hey, we don't know what's going to happen, but June is, June is around, right, right around the corner. Mm-hmm. And boom, here it is, man. We're almost about to get to halfway of June already, man. Right. You know what right. I'm saying? So, hey, things are, things are, days are speeding up, man. Oh. Hey, why are you trying for that? Mm-hmm. Hey, right. so, you know, with that, we hope this was edifying and informative to the elect. Hey, man, just keep your eyes out for these prophecies because they're they coming like rapid fire. Uh-huh. All right, but with that, we want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh. Until next time, Shalom.